Hello! Um, I'm just making a quick video so I can explain how I got the best results out of playing Assassin's Creed Valhalla, because it's not massively well optimised for PC, um, but there are a couple of things you can do, a couple of settings here and there, that make it work a lot better. It took me a while to work them out and went through different forums and stuff, so hopefully if you see this, hopefully one, will help improve your FPS, and two, it will remove stutter, which was a massive problem when I started playing this. Even with a high frame rate, there was a lot of stutter on the game. So this is what I did, basically. So obviously, when it comes to FPS, the lower you lower everything graphical settings-wise, it's going to improve the FPS, that's obvious. But if you have an NVIDIA graphics card, then use NVIDIA GeForce and use the NVIDIA GeForce optimized presets. That's what I did, and it by far made a massive improvement for FPS. But once that's done, there are some things you want to change. The first thing you want to change in the graphics option is anti-aliasing. Now, anti-aliasing has a massive um, FPS hit, but I don't think you see a massive difference in the actual game when you use it. So if you have it on high, that's the highest hit to your FPS you're going to get. If you have it on medium, I genuinely think you don't see very much. Maybe if you're in 4K, you might see a big difference, but I play in 1080p. I didn't see hardly any difference at all by setting to medium, but I gained about 10 to 20 FPS just setting this as differently. So give it a go, but I would say one of the main things you want to do is set anti-aliasing to medium. The second thing that you should do is check your screen refresh rate. Now, this was set for me to 60 hertz native, and my monitor isn't 60 hertz. My monitor is 144, and this seemed to cause a lot of like jittering and stuttering. When I set it up to 144, it started playing as smooth as you like. So, for some reason, the game thinks my panel is a native 60 hertz screen. I'm not sure why. Maybe it's because I've got two screens and it's picking up my secondary screen. But setting the refresh rate to 60 hertz, from 60 hertz native or whatever it picks up, make sure you're matching your monitor's um, refresh rate. And that seems to eliminate pretty much all of the stutter that I was personally experiencing in the game. So, and they're the two main things. Obviously, all the other settings are going to be depending on your PC setup, what, what graphics card, what CPU you have. So, they, they they just tweak those to your liking. But if you do have an NVIDIA card, I would definitely recommend using the NVIDIA optimized presets in the GeForce experience. And then going and changing the refresh rate to match your own monitor and turn anti-aliasing to medium. And one last thing I will say is, if you're a streamer and you have a NVIDIA graphics card as well and you're using the NVIDIA broadcast app for um, NVIDIA sound and NVIDIA camera, this game does not work well with that. So I find that I lose pretty much all of my performance on both the app and the game when I run them both in tandem. But if you turn the NVIDIA broadcaster app off, you should see an improvement as well overall in your gameplay within Assassin's Creed. I hope this has helped some people out because it took me a while to work these out. Leave some comments below if, I, if you think I'm right, if you think I'm wrong, what you personally have found works really well for this game, but hopefully this will help give you a little bit of a boost in FPS, but mostly get rid of the stutter, which was the worst part. Anyway, thanks for watching the video. Thanks, bye.